Hello again, guys. My name is Ravon Lee, and welcome back to Cyberpunk. Man, it's fun to be back recording again and actually playing the game that I want to play and record. Super fun. Um, first things that we want to do actually is to uh, change our character's hairstyle and the color a little bit. I wasn't super happy in the end with the character that we made. So let's actually do this. Mm. Change a little bit of our appearance. Uh, there you go. All right. So hairstyle and hair color are pretty much the only things that I need to change. I think we are going to go with something a little bit shorter. Uh, I will probably speed this up for you guys. Okay, I think we are going with this as our we. Uh, I do generally speaking like uh, red colored hair on characters. So we are going with this. I was debating with the last option as well because it kind of contrasted the tattoo. But then there was too much blue overall, so I figured we'd go with red instead. So that's our character from now on. Uh, let's close this and confirm. There you go. She does look a little bit like the, uh, the cover art that they're using for Phantom Liberty. And she's also been in the... Uh, previous cover arts, but definitely a different face. It's just the hairstyle. But I do like this hairstyle a little bit more than the previous one. And of course, the, the reason that we have the, the customization option overall is for us to change our character however we please. And I do think that hairstyle is one of those things that definitely changes as time goes by. Alright. Uh, I kind of cut a lot of the ending of the last episode. We did loot everything here and we did create our wardrobe for our character here. So we have a new glamour. So I'm not actually wearing these clothes that I have showing on my character. Uh, just to show you the outfit, how it looks like in the wardrobe section. Uh, this is pretty much it. So these are my clothes and that's the slot that we're using. So yeah, I kind of cut that off simply because it wasn't too important that my and my recording was cutting off. was getting a little bit annoyed by the constant uh, bugs that happened at the end of the episode. Did you find me? How did you know my name? Jones. I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. Later, V. All right. Now I do want to end up as a kind of con guns placing character, uh, but even though in the last episodes or the beginning of the episodes, come on, don't. Hit people randomly. Thank you. Give me the weapon. All right. So yeah, I, I'm definitely going that route this this time because I've already played stealthy, and I know that I did put a lot of reflex and uh, coolness to my character, but I like that aspect as a like an RPG aspect where my character does have coolness factor to her and uh, you know good to be here let's go downstairs and explore a little bit <laughs> Can I help you? Uh, it works. What are you? It works, man. <laughs> man, oh man. All right. Let's 
so let's go over here and do some boxing. Hey, yo, v. How about a yo. round or two? What do you say? Sure. How you like my new punching bag? Let's do this. Just gave me a next gen ass whooping. <laughs> next gen he ass whooping. <laughs> so how about it? How about it? Ah, uh, sure, this. why not? Light on your feet. Keep that head moving. Oh, couple hits. Come on. No! <laughs> All of a sudden just... Find some time, we'll work on your technique. Come on, I, I can do this, I can do this. Come on. Get on over. Damn. Sorry, I was being quiet. Focusing. What do you say? Uh, about these fights. Something about fighting. Mm. I've seen you land in blows in the ring. You've got sharp instinct, good edge. I do. Go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't legal, but very lucrative. Lucrative for who? You or me? Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings, you know, as your agent. All right. So, so you want to get rich from my work? Oh, I get it. Want to get rich off my blood, sweat, and tears? Hey, you got to make a buck somehow, right? Yeah, that's kind of how it goes. It to you Someone gives Might you a job, and you city. just do the job. Where you want to go? Put down your eddies and start swinging. You win, you take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them, you get a chance to fight the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. Yep. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. You can start in Kabuki. I believe Kabuki. In you. I guess I'll go there. Show this city what you made of. All right. <sighs> you go in the ring yourself. Not anymore. Skull's taking too much of a beating. Reflexes ain't what they used to be. Unlike my reflexes. Rather dish out my eddies for something else. It's time I started taking it easy. Alright. 
No, I didn't want to sit here. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Uh, how do I get out of here? Ah, uh, get up. Thanks. Okay. Now, I'm gonna change some settings here. Uh, I'll be right back. Needed to change uh, just the crouch and sprint so that it works a little bit better. Oh, I got a weapon. Apparently, or something. Let's, have Let's a see. Look. Uh, so this is the one that they are giving me. It's a verse weapon that I have. But I need to take it because it's a quest item. How much money do I have? Alright. There you go. Thanks a lot. Thanks. Let's see. Okay. One new weapon. That's a little bit better. Let's put on. Can't I put any scopes on these? No. Okay. I think I pretty much sell everything else. All right. Let's see what you got. What I like to hear. Well, pretty much everything else. I won't sell that. It's unique, I think, that one. So that, 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 and that. Do I have anything else to sell? That hat. Uh, pa, pa, pa. Guess I can keep those. Sell that. Junk items. Really need those. I wanna keep the counterfeit documents. Wanna keep those. Alright. I think we're done here. Thanks for the money. And let's head on over. Now here when we go to the Konpeki Plaza, I think it's Konpeki Plaza, but I'm not sure. But either way, no it's not Konpeki Plaza, it's something else. Uh, but I'd, either way, our FPS might drop quite significantly here, because this is an area that is pretty intense with character models. Right. So, are we going to talk about yesterday? It's all in the report. Oh, I read it. Except there's no mention of me telling you to delta the fuck out of there. Yeah, hmm. no biggie. Not like that cyber psycho was a tank on two chrome legs. Tank on fuck were you two thinking? chrome legs? Interesting. There's a reason Max Tag exists, you know. Civilians were in danger. What was I supposed to do? Just watch them get mowed down? Listen, you, me, and every fucking cop in this city might as well be a civilian next to Max Tag. The day they give us the gear they're packing, go right ahead, be the hero, save the fucking day. But until then, you keep your head down and listen to me. That understood? Rookie cop and a veteran cop, I guess. Alright. There's a lot that's going on in the city, it's just insane. Hello. Oh, sure. I'll, I'll sit next to you. Yeah. Let's see what you're eating. Didn't figure you as the type for Asian. Who thought you'd find it too exotic? What do you mean? What's there not to like? Noodles? Check. Since sirloin? Check. Get some more chile action up in here, and you're looking at Mama Well's signature sopa de fideos. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. <laughs> it just so happens, I do. I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but... Just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun, right? 
Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Badass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated cool. Oh. So you got a job from Dex? How'd you manage this? How'd you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You me? No. Oh, but t -Buck, she's the one that hooked us up. Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on. Ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. Tell me about Dex. Dexter Deshaun. What's the latest spec on him? No, you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was he took a little vacay. Two years? That's exile, not a vacation. The hell was he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while jerking off to hardcore virtues. The important thing is he's back. It's a fresh crew, and he found us. What's the job exactly? So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Well, our savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. No pressure, oh. but... Old deal's riding on you now, chica. Still getting system malfunctions. Need to get this flu fixed. Uh, don't see why not. Alright, let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. Do you know your way? Know my way around fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, Dios. Where you know? Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. Gave them to my guy yesterday for smooth over the dents. So. Okay, so I got my car back. Nice. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Mm. Oh, I need to call my car. Top notch work, Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory Let's go. new ride. Night City. Get on in. Ripper Duck. Anchica, easy on the gas, eh? I just ate. Sure. I was supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. Me and Misty. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know. You got a date with Misty. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. Come on. Uh huh. Okay. Basic cyberpunk shit. What? Man, this place looks so good. All the ads and just amazing. All right, let's go. Meet with the Ripper Doc. Oh. 
Misty's place. Maybe. Hello. Doctor Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. Ooh. You look pleased. Cause I am always makes for easier living. Yep, but that it does. We got a new job lined up from a big hitter at the afterlife. Oh, big hitter in the afterlife. Of course, it's gonna Don't be dangerous. You worry me, amor. We're bulletproof. Bulletproof. All right, let's read. Read some shards. Hello, anybody there? All right. Horoscopes storytelling group. Clients from group story storyteller. Client one out of 2077. Okay. MB Scorpio. You did it again. You rolled up your sleeves and cleaned the organs tables. Everyone admires you, but you know that your only reward will be the next task you're given. There are not many like you in Night City, but without you, the city could have long turned into shadows and dust. Avoid flirty a ALS that try to impress you with their knowledge of ancient Greek. You lucky. Your lucky place, Tenet. Okay, Capricorn. You're born Corpo. You plot, you plan, you calculate. You leave webs to tangle, so tangles, so tangled you sometimes lose yourself in them. If only you were the only one calling the shots, you would already have the city at your feet. Unfortunately, you're caught up in the maze of responsibilities, but whatever you're plotting, make sure you see it through to the end. Avoid last minute changes to plans. Your lucky place, Arasaka Tower. Gemini. Gemini. Uh, you know the city like the back of your hand. At night, you head out to just listen to the pulse of the streets. The juicy chatter, muffled screams, and drunken shouts just to soak up the atmosphere. You've been anywhere, you've tried everything. You're free, you're a free spirit, and night city. And in night city, that makes you a unicorn. Uh, avoid overworking your lucky place. Newsroom, newsroom. Okay, I'm Gemini myself. Uh, Taurus. You've done your time waiting in the shadows of others, but your patience finally paid off. The applause and flash photography are all yours. The world, world of media has opened its doors to you. Television, radio, brain dance, net. And this is just the beginning. Uh, avoid the waves crashing at your feet. Your lucky place, TV studio. Aries. When everyone was down, uh, down and out, you came storming back in style. This city loves people like you. It's how legends are born. You triumph in your triumphs is bittersweet. Uh, you, re you returned, but you're wound up on the street among the joy toys, con artists, and panhandlers. You know you've got bees here to take care of, but it can't get it can get tough when it feels like there's no end to its side. Uh, avoid sketchy repair docks. Your lucky place is Chick 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 Street. Leo. This city likes to devour players like you, but you know their kind too well to get caught off guard. You're on the ground. You know that city you know that in Night City, this only gets done when you put your blood, sweat and tears into it. Not just flimsy dreams. You eat dreamers for breakfast. Avoid gene gene genetically modified nuts. Okay. Your lucky place, Haywood. Aries. You've been in demand. You barely finish one task before someone someone's lined up to give you another. If It often seems that you're on your own, but always remember that you have a team you can count on. Avoid emotional policemen with, it, with difficult tasks. Uh, that's very specific. Your lucky place, a bar inspired by Babylonian culture. Uh, Capricorn, although you've been riding with nomads for years, you're a corpo at heart. You knew that from the moment you stepped into Konpeki Plaza, you felt at home there. You've had enough of camp life, constantly repairing generators and sand critting between your teeth. You've been given up ages. You have given up ages ago if you weren't so damn good at it. Avoid Raffan Shiv. Your lucky place, Konpeki Plaza. Note, highly sus. sus, sus, sus Suskeptical to Barnum effect. Huh. Here you go. You've been in the city for only a short time, but you already know that what uh, you know the what and the how. You've already ac accomplished the toughest part. You have a good team at your back. You've just been landing small jobs for now, but you know you're hungry for something bigger. Avoid getting attached to f attached to friendly uh, talking machines. <laughs> your lucky place, the music scene. Okay. Need. I'll read your emails. Can I say Please I've do. got my head in the clouds? Earth to be. Hello. Mm. Okay, let's go. Hello. Anybody there? No. No one is anywhere. No, well, hello. You got a big 
And you got a gun in your hand, little kid. Let's pet the cat. Come on. Who's a good cat? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's go. Now, I will be splitting these episodes a little bit from here on out. Makes editing a little bit easier. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Oh, kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Mm, heard of Dexter Deshaun? Met a new fixer. Gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshaun. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Hmm. Okay. I'll keep my guard up. Looking to upgrade? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to real shine. jobs. Get in the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Hey, you once the chops is done. Ryan, Vic, I'll bring you the Eddies later with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Hmm. Now, Jack, in. I'm getting a new eye. Oh no. Uh, Kiroshi, that's top self tech. Kiroshi, whoa! Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. Kin. You peruse and choose while I scan. See what's going on inside. Ocular system. Let's put some new eyes on. Nice. And uh, a hand thingy. Ballistic cop. Uh, Corpo cor, coprocessor. Coprocessor, okay. Increases the chance to ricochet shots with powerful weapons. Directly links the user's optical implant to the weapon system, offering real time data tracking. Confirm. That's it. Mm, what's the trade? Oh, I can trade here or something. Uh, Increases. Do I have money for any of these? Smart link. Increases mitigation chance. Okay. And where would those go? Is the other question. Can I put anything else? Oh, new lungs or heart. When your heart. Health drops to 15% release ele elect electro shock that deals damage equal to 20% of the target's max health. I remember that being very annoying. Let's see. Increases carrying capacity. Of course, we're gonna take that. Easy. Easy, easy. Mark one, like I said. These are enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. 
Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Okay, so cameras will not see my face. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Getting some cyberware. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. What's new in the life of Victor? So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Alright, let's place our alarm. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? It's like I'm at the play dentist. Play, though. Really, Doc? Makes you sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out Please don't minute, sleep. Right. Don't sleep now. Oh, my eye. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Good way of saying this might be a little bit buggy. <laughs> Uh, better than ever. Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. I can actually see. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust. But first time's rarely the charm. <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. Okay. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly. This is part of the game that I really disliked. <laughs> it auto worked like it's. Uh, now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. Uh, where Victor says that you can see other people, what they did and what, uh, you know, if they're a bad guy or something uh, and it's really showcasing that watchdog uh gameplay where you could actually see criminals and do something about that at least that was my take on it but eventually when you play the game it's not exactly like that and it keep me waiting all day What about the virus? How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full nice. sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Yay. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now and another two in an hour. What am I He's looking at? A mild stem should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks. You're the best, Vic. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. Yeah. And once you I hit will. the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. I won't. Jackie Wells is sending me. Messages. What's taking so long? Move your ass, chica. Dex is waiting on us. 
Sure. All right. I'm going to cut the episode here, do some editing on it, and we'll jump right back. So thanks everyone for watching. I know it's a little bit hectic when I'm recording and talking about all sorts of st stuff here and there. Uh, hope hopefully you can still follow up on the story and what's happening. Uh, so yeah, thanks and until next time. Bye bye.